Hey, what's up you guys? It's me, Mute, or Chris. I have a new series on my channel. It's called Video Request. Um, on one of my videos, I came across a subscriber who left me a... Oh, heck, sure. <laughs> left me a um, comment and requested to do a video. So that's pretty much what this series is. Just leave a comment, a uh, video request, and then I'll make a video out of it. So for this week, or this episode, it's from LEFPS. He left a comment about a week ago. Says, could you do a sniper class setup that tips tricks bid on sniping? I'll do the first one, uh, sniper class setup. Uh, tips and tricks, I'll do it on a separate video. So this is my classes that I use for sniping. Um, from everything that I use from attachments to perks and everything, I base it around like Optic Midnight, uh, Pomage, base apex and temper everybody else i just grab what they recommend or what they found out and then i use them so this is what i what i feel comfortable rolling with all right as you can see i'm on my third person no. uh, yeah <laughs> all right so vks uh this is my first um first class for this class it's more for the camperish type like if i have a camper uh, this is the perks that I use. It doesn't matter what sniper rifle. I just use these perks and um, strike package. So with the first one, I have the VKS. I just uh, use a extended mag because if they're camping up there, there's a whole bunch of them. You're going to want a little bit more bullets uh, to take them out. And I use the thermal scope. The reason why I use the thermal scope it does seem like it scopes a little bit faster. It could be a placebo for me, but it works for me. And I aim better with this one. Uh, when it comes to the regular scope, it's like a black uh, vertical line. It's hard for me to pretty much put the uh, crosshairs on the person. And uh, oh, here's my stats if you ever wonder. I'm at 1.25 KDR kills, deaths right there. Accuracy, uh, <laughs> Axe, Eco, wait, I shall play with you. <laughs> I'm making a video, sorry about that, you guys. And accuracy is 50 50, headshots 460. And the perks that I use is ready up. I have a habit of running a lot. Uh, it's necessary if you want that split second uh, time ahead to keep up with dying really quick. You're going to need that and quick draw as usual <laughs> you're gonna want that as well now sit rep i notice with a lot of uh campers they like to put ieds and all that other crap on the ground that kills you or distracts you or <laughs> just pretty much gives up your position with that at least i'm more aware and see where they're planting their stuff at so if i could go around them or just shoot it uh from the ground or wherever get rid of that and then amplify is necessary i like it because obviously the footsteps are a lot louder it does not increase the radius though but it makes it significantly louder so you can hear the footstep and wire tap uh with campers they tend to get a lot of kill streaks drop those sat comms and i use those sat comms against them um pretty much wire tapping into their stuff and support um if one thing about me uh, I always use support. I like to win when it comes to stats. I could care less about KDR. Winning is more important for me. And if I run a assault package, it's rare that I would get really high kill streaks because I'm always running and gunning and sniping. So let's see. I got Night Owl. It's one of my favorites. It's a pulsing radar that follows you. Like it has a certain radius, pulses. And the best thing about it is they throw a grenade or a flashbang or anything like that it'll absorb it it's completely gone and then i got support squad meet the reason why i use this guy is he would go into a room <laughs> actually go i love you bro um support squad mate would go into the room and clear it out for me he would or i just go out there into that room that they're camping in which is invade in there and then oracle Self-explanatory see-through walls, you know where they're staying at. Alright, so that gets the out of the way. Now this one is my 
quad class, like super aggressive. I'm trying to get montage clips of quads. And this is what I rock with. I got the USR, um, what's the guy, Chrome Blind. That does help out with the damage, bros and girls if you're a girl subscriber. And I do like the high penetration round. I don't know. Yeah, I, sometimes I switch it to extended mag. It, it goes back and forth. <laughs> I don't know. It's really up in the air to that one. And then the secondary, I have a P226 with the muzzle brake. I rarely use this uh, secondary. Majority of the time I have no secondary. The only time I use this one is one, if there's a dog, I'd snipe him and then switch quickly and just finish him off with a P226 or the secondary weapon. Oh, I didn't even get to show you my um, weapon stats. Here's my KDR 1.16. Accuracy is a lot better than the BKS. The BKS, oh no, I swear my crosshairs are on the people. Sometimes it doesn't connect. If you watch my um, Fieldtage video, it's the last clip. <laughs> you should just watch it. And it's pretty crazy what happened. And then 4% accuracy, 450 headshots. Now the perks, I uh, already went over with you why I use ready up and quick draw. I'm not gonna go over that. Slide of hand, uh, faster reloading time. So obviously reload fast. The reason why I want to reload faster is just in case I am out of bullets and I have that opportunity to get that quad feed. It's right there. Then I got Amplify, um, already went over that, and Focus. Focus is really, really important. Because um, if you get shot, you don't want to have that large flinch that goes up. That's how I have a lot of kills with my uh, when I get shot. Use Focus. Pretty much the best thing. It's a mandatory thing to have for quick scoping, sniping, whatever you guys want to call it. And then Strike Package. Already know, Night Owl, and then Ground Jammer. The reason why I like that, it blocks their radar and all their communications, all that crap. And they don't even know where I'll be coming from. Oracle went over with as well. And then let me go back to this one actually, the BKS. Right here, um, time to time, I tend to switch out Amplify for Focus. Focus is the biggest thing. For quick school. So necessary. So I got the links on my third class. This class is just rushing so much. Um got what? Armor piercing and thermal school. So got here. Pretty much the same things as the past ones. The only thing that I changed around is resilience, just so I could escape if I'm in high elevated places just in case I could jump right away. Like I said, this is my most aggressive class. Agility is another thing. Oh, this one's messaging me on. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Just got a Skype message. But anyway, yeah, that's pretty much it for that one. And then same thing as support. And that's basically it. Oh, yeah, if you're in case you're wondering why I don't have loadout 4, 5, and 6, I am saving up to get squad members, the last two squad members. I'm going to get it pretty soon. And uh, here, I'll even toss out another thing. Here's my stats. So, let's go to wins. 0 0.96, I know. Awfully low. What can I do? I do quit in mid game. Because you know you don't want to stay in a game that you're like losing and you can't win. Why even stay? <laughs> and then my kills. I'm at a 1.31. My one boat beam, my accuracy, 38.52, and as you can see, this is the most. This is the game that I mostly play. It's easy to get some feeds right here, then some TDM search. Hey, no, I did not play domination. See, I only like to play domination if I roll up with a crew, a squad. I that's why I don't play these kind of games. Usually playing by myself. And yeah. Oh yeah. If you want to know something actually interesting about this KDR, here's something. I only snipe in this game. I truly do. I as you can see, like 
it at 3,000 kills. Um, another 3,000. I rarely use this one. So, for example... Oh no, let's go... So, look at the stats on this. Like, how often I use that gun, right? But, the Remington... Got 94 kills. So... The MSBS is probably the gun that I use the most. 422 kills. And what else we got? S8, see? As you can see, I could, I barely use assault rifles. I strictly just snipe. I don't like to classify myself as a quick scoper. I just classify myself as a sniper. As a sniper, how I break it down is a sniper pretty much knows when to hard scope or when to quick scope. <laughs> I guess that's how I call it. But well, thanks you guys for watching this video. This is uh, a new series I'll have. Leave me a like if you like the video or leave me a comment uh, down below. Tell me if I should continue the series or leave me a question under the comments so I can make a new video. All right. So hope to see you guys soon. And if you ever want to play with me on Xbox One. Oh, yeah. As a matter of fact, this is on Xbox One. Just send me a message and all that good stuff. All right. Later.